after 30 days of intensive yoga, I was doing a teacher training down in the Bahamas, and they asked if he wanted a spiritual name at the end of it. And at first I thought, oh, well, I don't know if I need that, but I said, yeah, sure. So the name was given, and it was written just on the back of my diploma, and I read the word satya, and I, I didn't know what it meant. And they went on to say that it means truth. That evening was when I had the dream that I would start making jewelry of all truths and donate money to children around the world. So I called my best friend up immediately after that morning. I said, I've got the name. We have an idea. Let's start a business. So nine years later, here we are, and we've been going strong ever since. We have a 501c foundation. We donate to numerous orphanages all over the world. We work with a lot of celebrities on pieces and target places like Haiti, India, and work with children's organizations around the world. It's been really exciting. I can't wait to see what's next. My belief is that the past are many, but the truth is one. People come into our shops because they're looking for something special. Our hope is that any person can walk into one of our shops or go online and shop and find something that is true to themselves, something that warms their heart, whether it be a symbol that resonates within them or it's a stone that they're drawn to because of the healing property. The collection, there's such conversation around it. It's never, well, I saw you in a magazine and it really looks good. It's, I'm looking for a piece that'll help me through this transition in my life. Or my friend's getting married and I want to give her something that represents. So the jewelry is specific. It's very personal and it has such a conversation. People notice the jewelry because people are drawn to it for some symbolic reason. I believe that they emanate the energy around it. They sparkle. The most popular symbol that we sell is the lotus, and I think because it's so universal. All over Asia, the lotus grows in these big pools of mud, and basically out of that mud comes this untouched flower. To wear that, it reminds us, hey, this must be really tough, it's a really hard time in my life, but I know it's going to bring me to a better place. Our fall collection, Beauty in Motion, is a combination of tassels, movement, prayer beads. I thought, what better way but to bring it in drapes of stones and these tassels and movement, beauty, grace, the power of your own essence in the world. So we brought in a lot of bigger stones, a lot of bones, feeling the power that we all have within ourselves.